I'm one of the volunteer organizers, along with seven other organizers. If you guys could just raise your hands real fast. All right. Thank you guys so much for volunteering. Um, welcome to One Million Cups. We have any first timers here today? Uh, real quickly, how you guys? How'd you hear about us? Uh, I've heard about this for a while, and I just haven't had the time on my schedule. So I finally, uh, Jason Morgan convinced me to come out and uh, see what it's all about. So excited. And uh, was that Damien back there that raised Yeah, I'm every day. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. well, welcome, everyone. Uh, we are an educational program designed to connect, bring together, engage, motivate the entrepreneurs of Volusia County. We're so glad you guys could join us. This is a great organization. As you can tell from the turnout, uh, we have a lot of fun here, and we're all very excited to be part of the ecosystem, the entrepreneurial ecosystem in Volusia County. Every week we have a guest speaker, uh, either a startup or we do a success story. And uh, today I would say is probably a success story. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Gerard has been in business since 2011, and his company is Selic Games, and they do uh, innovative uh, educational games for children. Uh, he's based out of Winter Park. He goes to <coughs> Orlando when he can get out. He's a working CEO, very busy. Uh, we're so glad he could join us this morning. Please join me in welcoming Gerard. Well, I would say good morning again. And thank you for the opportunity, right? And thank you for coming out this morning to, to hear about my company, Select Games, Inc. And i can give you a little bit of background about myself. I've done 20 years plus in technology, so I've worked for the Lockheeds, the Siemens, I've worked for uh, Electronic Arts, for those who don't know. I did that too. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, I work for uh, Electronic Arts as well, so I've, I've had a long, long history in technology from programming, I don't program now, but program back in the day, uh, to software testing, all and, all and just a myriad of other roles. So technology has always been my heart and soul, even since I was a, even since I was a child. So brief agenda, just to give you guys some insight on where I'm going with this today. So let's talk about the history of Select Games. We started in July 20, 2011. And I have to give you a story about why we started in July 2011. Um, I had to take my niece to a parents teachers conference and unbeknownst to me, come to find out uh, the school diagnosed my niece with a learning disability. So, you know, getting that type of news the first time is kind of hard. And as an uncle, you don't want to believe it. So I told my niece, come on, let's leave. You know, we got the information and we left. And I went and got some pizza, got soda. And I said, you know what, we're still going to make this a fun day. So we get home, and I said, you know what, don't worry about it, you know, we'll, we'll figure things out. And we just started playing video games. So we're there playing video games, and this stuff is just racking my mind. But as we're playing, I'm noticing she started to tell me what to do. She's telling me the point system, she knows what different jewels or different things to pick up and what not to pick up. She started to tell me about the narrative within the game, so, you know, complicated story. And I'm looking at her, I'm like, wait a second, aren't you supposed to be slow? <laughs> and then that's when the light bulb went off. That's exactly when the light bulb went off. And I said to myself, wow, you're not being engaged in the way you need to be. And when we think about our educational system, it hasn't changed, right? And if you're, and if you're an entrepreneur or business owner, you know if your market or if your, 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 your customers or your clients change, what do you do? You change. Right? Why? Because you want to meet their needs. And, you know, what I've noticed when I've talked to teachers and I've talked to different principals, they have to stick within their box. And unfortunately, our children today are in that box. They're on their cell phones, right? How many of you have kids and all they do is on the cell phone all day long, right? Or the tablet or the laptop. And that's where I believe our educational system needs to meet them. You need to meet them on the grounds of which they walk. So, you know, this is where the brainchild of Select Games came about, and I realized, you know what, we have to look at educational gaming. And currently right now, yes, there are companies that create educational games, but they do it strictly from an educational standpoint, right? 
And what they fail to realize is that a game still needs to be what? Fun. Right? So, you know, they'll, they'll put animated numbers on the screen and they're like, well, we have a math game. Well, that doesn't work. Because kids look at that and say, well, you know, if they play Xbox, if they play PlayStation, they're like, it's not a game. It's just a bunch of numbers on the screen. Right? So kids don't like those games. So the approach that we take at Select Games is creating a game first and figuring out cool and innovative ways to infuse education in. Um, and let's be real clear, I do have an educational board. I have a board of directors of educators, PhD people who have gone through the, you know, from educational leadership to as well as teaching, right? And, you know, and, and understanding curriculum. So, let's talk about the pivot. Select Games has gone through some, some growth and some changes um, as the years gone by. Like I said, we started in 2011. And what I had to realize after going out and, and, and sourcing and talking to the different teachers and principals and trying to figure out ways to get into education institutions is that they need a proven product. They need a product that has been rigorously tested, has been reviewed, and also has metrics. So when I sat back, I said, well, wait a second, that's going to take me years to do before I even get into one educational institution, one school or something. So I had to kind of pivot, and in my pivot, technology is technology. Um, we use software, we use analytics, we, we have databases. So what I did was we created what is called CG Solutions Group, and that allows me and affords me the opportunity to now go out and do software development. So, you know, we, we do different things from enterprise development, software applications, mobile application development, websites, etc. And what we use, we use the funds from those um, initiatives and opportunities to help fund the educational game, right, to help sustain that. So, you know, business as a business, you know, we have several certifications, if, if you're familiar with that in the business world, the disadvantaged business, minority business, local developing business, we have several trademarks, and we are also a licensed developer for tons of different companies, as you can see, Sony, Nintendo, Steam, that's for the gaming, iOS for mobile devices, Android as well, and there's several other um, platforms that we are licensed with, and that's very important when you're looking at being a, a company that's, that has to be on different platforms, excuse me, on different hardware. You have to be licensed, and that's, and that's critical and pivotal. So, what have we done thus far? We have over 20 educational games released on iOS, Android, Windows, as well as we have a downloadable uh, for PC play, as well as play over the internet. We cross a multitude of demographics, primarily <coughs> we're focusing on K through 12, but we also do college and adult learners. So as you can see here, we have also have early childhood education, which is zero to three. And what we realize is that these kids are already on these tablets. Why not have them learning, right? Instead of just playing games senselessly, have them learning, have them, have them recognizing and, and growing their cognitive skills, their reasoning skills, their understanding skills. And what's one, the one major thing that we do at Select Games and that I pride myself is that I believe education should be for free. So none of my games, except for the adult side, have uh, fees to it. So all those games you can download for free, kids can play, they can test. And the reason why I believe in that is because if a parent does not have the financial resources, their kids should be limited. Kids should never be limited. Now when we look at CG Solutions Group, um, we are uh, an application developer for a federal agency, so we got a contract with the airport. That actually happened last year. Yeah. That, that took some time, but we, we, we did actually achieve that. And then we're also a database developer for a local county in Orange County. And I know One Million Cups is kind of county-based, but I believe One Million Cups, I'm One Million Cups for Florida. Yeah. So, yeah. One Million Cups for Florida. And, you know, with, with that being said, we actually built our prototype uh, reporting engine called SETS, which actually provides real analytical data, real time, from when the child plays and, she, and he or she stops. The student, excuse me, uh, the principal, the, the parent, or the teacher gets those metrics immediately. Immediately. Right? So, you know, the, these are the type of things that we're working on as far as on the select game side. So, let me show you what... CG Solution Group is about.
So with CG Solutions Group, we believe in, in that division of select games that you can implement technology in many different facets, from medical training, as you saw, construction, security, as well as safety training. So we help design and develop uh, that type of curriculum around whatever job function you have. Um, training is training. And you know when you look at the, the, the amount of hours you have to take subject matter experts off of the job that they're doing, which could be pivotal or critical to, to your institution or to your, to your company to help train someone, you can use that in technology, right? And, and what we like to say is that we partner with anyone who looks for our services to say, look, we, we're not experts in, 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 your, in your field or industry. We're experts in technology. Tell us what you need and we'll build around it. Another thing about us is that we always believe in being able to make the technology mobile, right? So not being grounded to a PC or a laptop, being able to do it on a tablet, being able to do it on the go. Because when you look at your, your, your employee base, they're always on the move. And you want to keep them always on the move. Um, you know, doing their craft. So, you know, these are some of the, our, our capabilities that we've done uh, throughout, throughout our existence. So, what's on the horizon for Select Games, Inc.? Um, we're currently working on another educational title called Cell Squadron. This is to teach kids from elementary to middle school how blood flow works, how cells interact with one another, um, what happens when the body gets sick, and how you need to fight off um, disease and infection. Um, what uh, CG Solution Group has coming on the horizon is something called My Event. I'm going to show you that very shortly. More apps. We're getting more into virtual reality, augmented reality. So we're looking to, to see, you know, as, as hardware progresses, how we can progress our services into the future. So let me give you a little insight to what My Event It is. Got an event on the horizon? Planning one can quickly become a nightmare. Thankfully. <laughs> Thank you, Bright <laughs> Fully, it doesn't have to be. Thanks to myeventit.com. This is the event management platform, putting all documentation on all attendees' devices for constant ease of access. With myeventit.com, you can sell tickets, products, and services, and even accept donations, send real-time notifications, and ultimately create the digital event that dreams are made of with our robust feature set. Sign up today to see just how simple event planning can truly be. Yes, so myeventit.com um, is actually an event management platform that we've been developing. We're looking to release it next week. We were supposed to do it today, but some complications as in technology, things happen. Um, but what we're doing now is looking at problems and looking at different systems that are out in the world today, and we're combining them. So, you know, that's one of our new goals, and hopefully, you know, we, we get a good turnout and a, and a good download on myevented.com. So, that's it. I thank you all once again for having me here. <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to